Io. In today's video we will talk about Abdusalam Gedesov, Russian freestyle wrestler, for time Russian champion, to time European champion and world champion, who competed in the category up to 97 kilograms. Abdusalam Gedesov was born and grew up in Makhachkala, of Avar ethnicity. From his early years the boy was interested in sports, martial arts. It is true that Abdusalam was first interested in martial arts. He went to two martial arts classes simultaneously, Wushu Sende and kickboxing. But, when Abdusalam Gedesov turned 11, his father believed that he would be able to achieve much more in a more classic sport. That's why he ended up choosing freestyle wrestling. Later, in order to gain mass, Abdusalam Gedesov began to regularly attend the gym, where he began to train hard with iron. But later he quickly understood that in wrestling technical training is much more important than muscle mass or even strength, and as a result training with iron moved into the background. To put it crudely, at the youth competitions the wrestler did not grab the stars from the sky. Of course, the guy was worried, but his coaches told him that if he did not lose heart and would continue to work hard at his training as before, the results would come. And, as time showed, the coaches were right. As I said, Abdusalam Gedesav did not achieve phenomenal results at the youth level, but as he grew up, victories began to come to him more often. In 2008 the young wrestler managed to win the championship of the Russian Federation and right after that, the Youth World Championship. In 2009 he performed at the Adult World Championships, where he got the strongest cut of his eyebrow, which subsequently led to the fact that any blow to the head during the bouts caused bleeding. The fighter himself recalls that he bled on the mat almost every fight, but he kept on fighting. At those moments he was afraid of one thing, the referee would not stop the fight. It was also because of weight loss. His body got dehydrated very quickly and the skin became too thin. But, Gadisov got rid of these problems after he moved in 2011 to the weight class up to 97 kilograms. His victories in competitions were increasing. The wrestler from Makhachkala won the championship of Russia. Also he became the best in Ivan Yerijin and Ramzan Kadyrov's cups. The wrestler didn't fall behind on the international scene either. Abdusalam Gedesov twice won European Championships and was first at World Cup 2010 and World Cup 2014. At the 2012 Olympic Games in London, Gedesov took only ninth place. The reason being that the early stage of the tournament grid pitted him against the world's strongest wrestler, the Iranian Reza Yazdani. Of course, that was not the only loss. At the 2015 World Championships, held in Las Vegas, Abdusalam unexpectedly lost to 18-year-old American debutant Carl Snyder. During the tournament, his leg crunched and after his return from America, Gadisov's meniscus jammed. As a result, he had to undergo surgery on both knees. In May 2016, the wrestler took part in the Russian Freestyle Wrestling Championship. It was an important stage of selection for the 2016 Olympics. Everyone thought that the main fight would be between Enzabolchukhev and Abdusalam Gedesov, but, there was a scandal at the competition. All Dagestani men refused to fight in the quarterfinals because they disagreed with the judging in the fight between Viktor Labadev and Ismail Musakhev. As a result, Gadisov had to forget about the Olympics. In early 2017, Gadisov decided to finish his sports career, and soon he was invited to the coaching staff of the Russian national team as a senior coach. But, in November of the same year, Abdusalam decided to return to the mat. Gedesov took part at the International Dave Schultz Memorial Tournament. True, at this tournament he only managed to fight one bout. Abdusalam's opponent was an American Blaze Cable. During the whole fight Gedesov was winning but with a minute and a half to go he was taken to the back by the rival with a leg hook from inside and he lost by straw. Abdusalam Gedesov was repeatedly called to try himself in mixed martial arts. And if earlier the Dagestani wrestler did not rule out such a possibility, today he is fully focused on coaching in the national team, 